never want to be alone again Now that I have found a love that never ends Everything you are is all I hope to be yeah. Our trusty driver Our trusty chauffeur Yeah That problems with that trash. <laughs> So Plumley, what's the pressure like uh, right here before the final? Pressure's not on me. Pressure's on Roddy. Oh, pressure on Roddy. Roddy, how do you, how do you feel? How do you feel about taking the pressure, Rod? Uh, I really feel that uh, there's really not much pressure at all. I'm a big time player in a big time game here. So are you saying that Plumley's not a he's not a finisher? Is that what you're saying? No, uh, he's, he's always been a, a first, first quarter man. <laughs> first quarter. He's not a fourth quarter man. When the game's on the line, he's on the bench. That's why I'm not you right. So this is what it comes down to. We'll see how it ends. That door's opening. Both of these, there's no way I can win it. That's a big gift, though. Oh, man, come on. Come on. Thank you, Jay. Come on, Jay. Come on, Jay. Come on, Oh my goodness. You know what, Tom? Right now you're just playing scrub minutes. That's the game's over. You know, it's kind of like a pill. Oh, I knew. I knew. <laughs> Don't bring that up. I was waiting wait for it to come around. It's kind of like penal. You stayed home, we'd have won that game. Right. You didn't stay home. You wanted to be the hero. 
What's that basketball game that you screwed up on? I can't tell you. you can't, remember, I can't tell you. <laughs> Sometimes the truth hurts. Okay. Right. 59 for Sonny, 65 for me, 78 for both. Mm. Only person that didn't miss a bird was Chad. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> so Tommy, how does it feel uh, having having recorded your first shooting shooting uh, title of the um, the bird conservationist? Because the man that doesn't the man that doesn't hit the most targets is always considered just the uh, ecologically friendly guy. Well, do you do you like being associated with um, the Democratic Party? And those uh, ecological uh, weirdos. Well, I'm around Michael a lot, so I mean, he's weirdo <laughs> enough. So ain't no, ain't no difference what I'm used to. Uh, oh, so you're yeah. saying he's got a little Al Gore in him, is what you're saying? He got that. a little bit of a bomb in him. A little, I think I see it. Uh, a little bomb in there. Full yeah. no, uh, nose. <laughs> Yes. Papa, how's that shoulder feeling? Feels good. Yeah, yeah. Get a little rub down tonight. Yeah. Um, it kind of put a little deep peat on there, kind of loosen it up. Who's going, who's going to apply that deep peat on there? I'm going to apply it to myself. Just apply it right there to the shoulder. I'll be okay. Thank you for asking that. Is Amy going to be involved in this uh, massaging technique? No, it'll just be myself. You're going to be asleep by the time we get home. <laughs> It'll be just myself. I can promise you that. Uh, so, well, are you gonna get Bryce to walk on your back when you get home? Since you were used to carrying Tommy all the way around this course. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> Chad, I'm about to turn around, and pose for the camera. <laughs> we are in the country. Just realize. I think we shoot another round. <laughs> Got a left hand gun. <laughs> There it is. Look at Roddy. Oh, take it oh, off, Roddy. Man. Take it off. <laughs> nice. And then, <laughs> this is the boys. I don't believe I'd be a good idea. We're, we're out for Myrtle Grove. See you next time. <laughs>